Hi, I was just doing this um, for my uh, leadership. This is what I would have presented on the 17th. Uh, sorry, I was still out sick, so I, I apologize. Um, but no, I job shadowed uh, uh, Taylor Stoutner. I chose to do that because, um, you know, since I started working uh, for McGrath, uh, a, he was one of the first managers that I did a deal with. He was always just a very... I loved how type A he is. He's just very straight to the point, gets right to uh, what what needs to be done um, and how to move the deal forward. Um, it was always just such a calming influence. And so I, uh, it, you know, and now he's the, the GM of our store. So I figured I would just go right to the top. And um, basically what I saw was is that he, he um, starts the day really with the other managers uh, kind of, going over numbers, going over hot leads, uh, um, whatever else to get the dealership's sales kind of moving forward, checking in on everything. And that really seemed to be the overarching thing that I found as I, as I followed him around is what he showed me is that it was, he's really there to kind of hold people accountable, um, you know, to their feet, to the fire, if you will. Uh, he can look in on leads on VIN after he goes through kind of a checklist that he has for things he weekly, that, that he does, that have to be done either daily or once a week. Um, then he starts really going through VIN and basically keeping the salespeople, um, uh, other sales managers uh, all accountable. And then also he checks in on any deals that are pending. I mean, it's really just, it was, it seemed like he just kind of had his fingers and everything. Um, and it was cool to watch because it really is, it shows that, um, we all have to work it, you know, everybody's kind of working autonomous, autonomously yet uh, with, with uh, VIN solutions and stuff like that. He can really keep this kind of uh, overarching control to some of it. I mean, it's just like a, a general in a, in, a, uh, in a battle almost in that they, you have to trust your, your lower damn troops to do their job, but it still doesn't mean that you just leave them to do whatever they want. Um, but it was, yeah, it was cool to watch. It was also, uh, I asked him, you know, what he missed. And he says he missed doing deals, which I could see, um, somebody like that, you know, somebody where he likes to do these, you know, quick decisions, kind of, uh, let's get it done. It's, it's, there's a, there's a reward at the end of that. Um, I could see missing that, but yeah, it was very fun. It was very informative. Thank you.